When planning long-haul flights, passengers often notice that aircraft tend to avoid flying directly over the vast Pacific Ocean. Instead, flight paths often appear to take a longer route, skirting along the coasts of North America and Asia. This observation raises an intriguing question. Why don't planes fly directly over the Pacific Ocean? Here, we explore the various reasons behind this aviation mystery. Safety concerns. The vastness of the ocean. One of the primary reasons planes avoid flying over the Pacific Ocean is the safety concerns associated with flying over vast stretches of water. In the event of an emergency, such as engine failure or other critical issues, pilots need options for landing. Over land, there are airports or open fields available, but over the ocean, options are significantly limited. Aviation regulations mandate that flights should maintain a certain level of safety by ensuring that they are always within a reasonable distance from airports. This protocol aims to provide pilots with alternate landing sites in case of emergencies. A notable example of this concern occurred in 2014 with Malaysia Airlines Flight MH370, which disappeared over the Indian Ocean. The mystery surrounding its disappearance highlighted the challenges and risks associated with flying over vast, uninhabited areas, raising alarms about the potential for accidents and emergencies. Air Traffic Control Limitations The Pacific Ocean is not only vast, but also relatively isolated when it comes to air traffic control. The sheer size of the ocean makes it challenging for air traffic controllers to monitor and manage aircraft flying over it. While there are air traffic control systems in place, the coverage is often sparse in remote oceanic regions. This limited coverage can lead to gaps in communication and tracking, making it difficult for controllers to monitor flight paths and ensure safety. Aircraft flying over land have a more extensive network of air traffic control towers, which facilitate better coordination and communication. In contrast, flying over the Pacific may necessitate longer intervals between communications, making it harder to respond to any issues that may arise. Fuel Efficiency and Routing Flight paths are meticulously planned for fuel efficiency, taking into account the most economical routes. While flying over the Pacific Ocean may seem like a direct route, it is often not the most fuel-efficient option due to prevailing winds and weather patterns. Pilots and airlines consider the influence of jet streams, fast-flowing air currents in the atmosphere, when planning routes. These winds can significantly impact fuel consumption. Airlines often choose routes that take advantage of tailwinds, reducing overall flight time and fuel costs. For instance, flights traveling between North America and Asia often take a route that arcs northward, allowing them to catch favorable winds while avoiding the more challenging conditions found directly over the Pacific. This not only saves fuel but also time, making the flight more efficient. Weather Patterns and Turbulence the Pacific Ocean is notorious for its unpredictable weather patterns which can pose challenges for airlines. Storms, turbulence, and varying weather conditions can significantly affect flights, making routes over the ocean less appealing. Meteorologists closely monitor weather patterns to predict turbulence and storm activity. Flights that skirt the edges of the ocean can avoid severe weather, providing a smoother and safer travel experience for passengers. There have been numerous instances of severe turbulence over the Pacific, leading to injuries among passengers and crew. By avoiding certain areas and opting for more stable weather conditions, geopolitical factors. Geopolitical considerations can also influence flight paths. Some regions over the Pacific may involve complex airspace restrictions due to military operations or political tensions between countries. Certain areas may be restricted for civilian flights due to national security concerns, leading airlines to adjust their routes accordingly. For example, military operations in the South China Sea have resulted in increased restrictions on airspace, compelling airlines to navigate around these zones to avoid any potential conflicts or misunderstandings. Aircraft Limitations and Design Modern commercial aircraft are designed to fly long distances. However, there are limitations related to the operational range of certain planes. Factors such as fuel capacity, weight, and engine performance play a significant role in determining how far a plane can fly without needing to refuel. Many aircraft have specific ranges that dictate their operational capabilities. While some planes can fly directly across the Pacific, others are limited in how far they can travel without landing for fuel. For instance, short-haul aircraft cannot make transatlantic flights without stopping for fuel, which impacts how airlines schedule routes and manage their fleets. Passenger Comfort and Preferences Airlines prioritize passenger comfort and experiences when planning routes. 
Long flights over the ocean can be daunting for travelers, leading airlines to choose paths that minimize time spent in the air and maximize comfort. Passengers generally prefer flights that feel shorter and less taxing. By opting for routes that provide a balance between distance and comfort, airlines cater to customer preferences, enhancing the overall travel experience. Some airlines have introduced innovative strategies to make long-haul flights more comfortable, such as adjusting cabin pressure and humidity levels. Additionally, flight paths that allow for smoother rides can contribute to a more pleasant journey for passengers. Technological Advances in Navigation Advancements in aviation technology have improved navigation capabilities, allowing airlines to plan more efficient routes. However, older systems and protocols may still play a role in determining flight paths, especially for airlines that operate under specific guidelines. Today's aircraft are equipped with sophisticated navigation systems that allow for precise route planning. However, regulatory frameworks and traditional practices may still influence decisions, leading to continued avoidance of direct ocean routes. As technology continues to evolve, we may see more direct flights over the Pacific as airlines embrace new systems that enhance safety and efficiency. This shift could lead to more streamlined routes that better serve passengers. Economic considerations. Economic factors also influence flight paths. Airlines must balance operational costs with the need to provide profitable routes. Avoiding the Pacific Ocean can sometimes align with economic goals by maximizing passenger loads and minimizing fuel expenses. By optimizing routes that reduce operational costs, airlines can maintain profitability while offering competitive pricing. Direct ocean routes may not always align with these economic objectives. Airlines often analyze passenger demand, fuel prices, and operational costs when determining routes. By selecting paths that align with economic considerations, they can enhance profitability while ensuring passenger satisfaction. Future Trends Evolving Aviation Practices As the aviation industry continues to evolve, we can expect changes in how airlines approach flight paths over the Pacific Ocean. Advances in technology, shifts in passenger preferences, and an emphasis on sustainability may May lead to more direct routes in the future. With ongoing developments in aviation technology, airlines are likely to explore new routes that take advantage of improved navigation systems and fuel-efficient aircraft. The prospect of electric or hybrid planes may also influence how routes are planned in the coming years. As sustainability becomes a greater focus in the aviation industry, airlines may prioritize routes that minimize their carbon footprint. This could involve direct flights over the Pacific that reduce overall travel time and fuel consumption. Now that we've uncovered the mystery behind why planes avoid the Pacific Ocean, what are your thoughts? Were you surprised by the reasons? Let us know in the comments below. If you found this video enlightening, make sure to give it a like and share it with others who love unraveling these hidden truths. Hit the subscribe button. Thanks for watching. And as always, question everything.